our viewer, we bless the Lord for allowing us to be with you again. It's another Good Friday. It's your show, Divine Encounter. And I'm your host, Reverend Ruth Wamoyo. And this is Dan M. Amen. Amen. Wonderful, Pastor. How has been your week? It's been awesome. Amen. I've been traveling. I've been ministering. Mm -hmm. Yes. Worshiping God. Amen. Enjoying myself in the presence. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. I've also been around within, mm -hmm. serving God. Hallelujah. I've not traveled in any outside Kenya or outside <laughs> town. But Amen. here we are, Praise still God. praising the Lord. Glory to we God. begin Jerusalem first. Yes. And to the, out, to the uttermost parts of mm -hmm. the earth. Mm -hmm. We bless the Lord. We have the CTN band here. Hi, I believe they are looking gorgeous. Celebrate them in the house. And our beautiful audience, may the Lord God bless you for being with us. Amen. I believe that today we are going to have a wonderful, wonderful time together. I can feel it already. I am looking forward to the moments that we are having. Yes. Because today we have a very interesting topic. Definitely. We will introduce it to you after this break. God bless you. Once again, welcome our viewer. It's another good day and we told you today we have a very hot topic. Yes. And before we, inter we introduce that hot topic, there are mm. some people that have been talking to us. Yes. You know, Divine Encounter is where the serious people who worship, that is where they go. This is their and, place. Uh, and actually, that is what they watch. Yes. And we've been having some serious, serious feedback. Mm -hmm. And we're going to read them shortly. Yes. And just tell our viewer, thank you. Mm. But wherever you're watching us from, write your name. Uh, and, and also write on the text or maybe the Facebook page and make sure you write is the, your show Divine Encounter. And as we hold on together, I believe you will have a testimony by the end of this show. In case you're not born again, it is an opportunity for you to receive Jesus. In case you're sick in your body, come on, the power of Jesus is ready to heal you wherever you are. Yes. What is the topic of the day? Uh, uh, today's topic is one of the best topics that I've, I, I think. Yes. The, the place of the song and the music Amen. in worship. Amen. And I believe that it's going to be able to revolutionize yes. even the praise and worship leaders in our churches. Amen. I believe we, we, we have something for them. Mm -hmm. And I believe that God is going to be speaking to us yes. as worship leaders through this particular topic. Amen. And I believe you're going to get blessed, all of you. And all of us, we are here ready for you. Amen. Yes. So the topic today is... How do I choose songs mm -hmm. if I'm a worship leader? Yes. Are there right songs? Are there wrong songs? Mm -hmm. And uh, we were discussing it behind the scenes before we began. Mm -hmm. And we had some very, very light moments. Oh, yes. Because we were talking about several things that mm -hmm. you require for, for the worship leading uh, you know, ministry to be effective. Oh, yes. And one of the things we say that you must consider the audience. Our audience, Bona Sifiwe. Amen. We must consider the audience. Uh, sometimes, uh, I, I've been to a funeral, uh -huh. and there came this power worshiper. He did not discern the moments. <laughs> <laughs> so he started singing. Mm -hmm. There's a Kigosho song that says, uh -huh. and it's good. Yes. But then the way she sang it, and, uh, uh, and she sang it, and it was powerful. Yes. But then everybody was just looking. Seriously. Mm -hmm. I need consolation. I need a song that can console. I need a song yes. that tell me it is well with my mm -hmm. song. And there are other places where you've been to a church service. Yes. And a worship leader begins. Ingia, ingia. Ingia, ingia. Ingia, ingia. Uwe moja wa kodo. And I was, I've always been telling people, those who are in church are already kodo. Obviously. They, well, shy yeah, so that's a soul winning song. Yes. So our viewer, it's a wonderful topic mm -hmm. when you know what to sing, even not only as a worship leader, yes. even in your closet. And I believe today we're going to be a bit controversial. Yes. Get ready because we're going to be a bit controversial. Amen. You, you may be offended, but we're going to help you. It's true. Mm -hmm. Glory to God. Amen. So our, our Christian band, I believe all of us are ready to give us the first song. It says, Roho yangu na ikuimbie. Our audience, you're welcome to join us. And God bless you. And our viewer, keep tweeting, keep Instagramming, Facebooking, SMSing, hi hiing us just on your screen because we love you and we appreciate you. Amen. Amen. Peace. 
wonderful. Come on, let's celebrate Jesus in the house. Hallelujah. Isn't it wonderful? Come on, let's do it better for Jesus. Hallelujah. Isn't it wonderful? Isn't it wonderful? Isn't it wonderful? Isn't it wonderful? Hey. Amen. Hallelujah. Wonderful. We are having some wonderful people that are watching us from Kawangware, oh. uh, from Gong, yes. from Umoja, yes. Uthiru, Kasarani, South B, Madare North. And they're all saying we are enjoying divine encounter. Praise God. And uh, they are talking about all the topics we've been talking. <laughs> and they're saying we've been a blessing. Praise we give God. God glory for you. Keep Hallelujah. talking to us. SMS yes. us. Write to us. Tell us topics that you would, uh, want us to discuss. Our topic today is how do you choose songs? Yes. And uh, we say number one that you must look at the audience. Definitely. Number two, you must look at the culture of the people. Sure you must. I don't know whether it concerns you, but um, mostly in our Kenyan churches. Yes. It almost seems backward when we sing songs in our dialect. Mm -hmm. It seems like we are not fashionable. Mm -hmm. Like when you sing Kikuyu songs, you look like you, you are backward. Yes. What do you think about that? Uh, I, I don't think it's a right, and it's, I don't think it's the it's a good thing yes. to think like that. Yes. Because one of the things that I came to realize, mm -hmm. as we lead the worship, as we lead people, as a song leader, yes, uh, I came to realize there is power in the songs of someone's or the people that belongs to that locality yes. when you sing in their language. It's very true. You sing in a language they can understand it's, all of them. It's true. For example, sometimes you can be in a service, yep. and people they are praising. Yes. The songs in English, you know, yes. the English songs. Mm -hmm. I love English songs. Yes. Swahili songs. I love Swahili songs. Yes. And even other tribes, even international even, yes. uh, languages like uh, from South, South Africa, Africa, Nigerian. South Africa, yeah. But the moment you put in Kegosho, yes. Kaiwa, you hear. Ah! Yes. Everybody gets excited. Because your mother tongue, you connect better with your mother tongue. It is tongue. true. Yes. It, is powerful. Yes. it is powerful. And I believe as, as we choose songs, yes. we cannot extract yep. our, our, the songs from our languages. That's true. They are so powerful. Yes. They are full of the power. Mm. There is someone who I don't know whether you, you grew up in a background like mine where we used to sing hymns. Yes. Like the one we've sung. Yes. And there is a song you would sing like mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 Those songs would release the sorrow of the cross exactly. upon your life. Amen. And suddenly, even if you wanted to be remorseful about mm -hmm. something, mm -hmm. it became it made it easier for you. It is true. Made it easier for it you true. to it remember the power of the it cross. It is true. Amen. It is true. Glory it is, to it God. It is so powerful mm -hmm. when when we do not throw away. Yes. The songs that we sang even in the old. That's true. As much as we write new songs, yes. we cannot afford to throw those sing songs that we sang in the olden days. That's true. Those songs, they had power. Yes. Some of the choruses we sang those old, old mm -hmm. days. Yeah. I mean, they have so much power. I mean, you just sing one of them. Yes. And you begin to see people respond. Glory to God. And on that note, we are coming back to discuss about the message in the song. Exactly. Because it's not just any song that fits to be a song that can be sung in worship. Mm. Uh, we, are, we, are, we are coming back, to after, back after this break. God bless you. Amen. Welcome back, our viewer, after this break. Uh, we've had a wonderful time. We are talking about the choice of song in worship. We're yes. going to be led by Minister Beatrice, our very beloved Beatrice, with a song, Because It Lives. I can face tomorrow. Mm. I request our beautiful audience, you can join us because our tomorrow is indeed great. Love Jesus. Because he lives, I can face tomorrow. Because he lives. Hallelujah. Hope he is Because I know
Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Father, we give you praise. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. What a wonderful thing to worship him. It is true indeed. It is indeed a wonderful thing. Amen. Our viewer, Keep It CTN, we are already drunk in the presence of God. Mm. We are already enjoying the presence of his majesty. Hallelujah. We want you, wherever you are, we kindly request you write to us your name, where you're watching us from, and your expectation and your feedback about this program. And Sister Furaha, you've led us powerfully in that song. Mm. Can you tell us why you chose that song and not Ndani, Ndani, Ndani? <laughs> <laughs> Um, when, when you are choosing a worship song, yes. you have to, to meditate or, uh, or um, what can I say, uh, uh, emphasize on the words that are in the song. Because yeah. some songs have, have good tunes, but they don't have the right words of worship. Sure. Yeah, so you have to kuangalia kabisa, if that song that you're about to sing, does it have worship words? Does, does the words in that song worship God or niza kuingiza watu ama niza ku entertain what you should you should observe on that kabisa whereas, whereas there is nothing wrong with entertainment I yeah. believe just as the Bible says there is everything for every season yeah, yeah. is there a song that has ever been sung somewhere and it really stumbled you as a worshipper yes can you give us an example uh, <laughs> there was a time I went to another worship experience yes like the whole worship experience they were a cook what and a song moja worship all zote zilikuwa uh prayer songs yeah uh for uh, instance uh like uh mm, uh sisi wana wako tumekusanyika angalia baba yes it's not a worship song it's a song that that gathers it's people. a song of supplication yeah yeah, yeah. Okay. so like when you are when you when you uh when you declare a worship experience, make sure that the songs that you are going to sing yes. are worship songs unto the Lord. Amen. Yeah. Uh, let me turn to my left to this beautiful yellow, yellow sister called Zippy. She looks good in that outfit. Um, does that mean that singing songs of supplication are bad? Or let me phrase the question. At what point before, before or in between or after should we sing songs like Usini Peter Mokozi? experience as a worship leader. Yes. The mistakes I've ever done. Yes. And now what I'm learning. Yes. Sometimes you could be going through something. Yes. <laughs> hey, tell us. <laughs> You've gone maybe through like a heartbreak. Yes. And so you're heartbreak. A, 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 <laughs> I like that's a powerful word. So Not just like a small it's a heartbreak. Okay. Yeah. It's, it's like a big one. Yes. So you come to church and you're expected to lead. Yes. And you're in a season of mourning. Yes. So when you come on the pulpit, the songs yeah. that are coming yes. are songs like Uni Tete Siya Na Uni Tete And so you're crying and it's not about yes. really what, yes. what God is. Yes. It's the wrong things that I have ever done. Yes. Singing songs because I'm in a situation. Yes. yes. Wow, that is uh, revealing. That heartbreak <laughs> can make you do things. May you not suffer a heartbreak. Our viewer, and in case you suffer that heartbreak, may you recover so quickly in Jesus' name. Amen. And I'll ask Ibrahim. Worship to me, Kabisa, Wame Valia. I love what you perform. Guam don't walk in Basong. I fire. Yeah, you get to in happen. In happen, son. Una Una Jua, Kuna in Bajuengi, Wanazania, worship the beat. Wanazaki and Yimba Boy and Aslo. Wow. Io Yimbo. It is powerful. It is true. It is true. I have, I have, I have experienced that. Slow is not worship. Places, I've gone places and I've realized it is true. It is wow. wrongly interpreted. Yeah. It is true. <laughs> keep, keep talking. Uh, Sasa, you unapata mtu anaimba nyimbo, anaita mwimbo, hii nyimbo ni ya worship. Hii nyimbo ni ya worship juu, anasikia beats, hiko na beats, hiko slow. Worship ni what? Oh. Worship, see your tune. Mm -hmm. Sio ile inaweza kuwa nyimbo ya praise mm -hmm. inaenda na beat inaenda na beat ya haraka lakini iko na words ambazo zina worship Mungu. Na inaweza kuwa inaenda slow mm -hmm. na iko na words zina worship Mungu. Kwa hiyo kuna watu wanafanya hiyo confusion. Yeah. Wanafanya hiyo confusion. Kwa hiyo inakuwa unakuwa wewe umeenda umeingia hapo watu wanaanza kuimba nyimbo kama hizo unakuwa kama uko uko nje. Ni kweli. Hawakubariki. Ni kweli. Yeah. 
hata mimi nimekuwa na hizo experience uh -huh. lakini ni vizuri tuambie audience difference ya praise na worship the bible says enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise so where does worship coming in it's not mentioned there mm -hmm. whereas worship is to hallow is to adore yes. when you get into the presence of god i believe as a worshiper the first thing you do remember what god has done it is true. don't come with a profile of what he has not done mm -hmm. god you know i prayed last year it has not happened now you have not done mm -hmm. when you approach him remind him god i prayed and i know you are still coming mm -hmm. i give you thanks in advance yes. Yes. Praise is when we praise him, is when we tell about his goodness. Sure. It may not be direct, direct to him, it may be about him also. Mm. Yes. Uh, but it depends on how we, we sing it. Mm -hmm. we, we separate it as praise because sometimes praise involves the body. Sure. There some, must be some body workout mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and it's good. But when worship cannot happen until you praise God, until and your spirit broken. is broken. Yes, yes, Amen. Yes. I believe, Pastor Dan, you can tell us more. It, it is true because yes. uh, praise, I tend to believe it is because of the things he has already done. Yes. It is according to the deeds and the doings of yes. the Lord. But worship is about who he is. Yes. When you begin to approach him, you begin to tell him, indeed you are God. Yes. Indeed you are holy. Yes. Indeed you are worthy. Yes. Not because of it's what you did. It's about his person. It's not because of what you did. You have done. Even if you didn't do it, yes. you still deserve a worship. Yes. You are still holy. You are still, you're still mighty. You are good. Amen. Even if you didn't do it, your you mercy endure forever, forever and ever. You must forever. Amen. So sometimes it is good to differentiate. Between. I come and praise. Yes. Because he's already done it for me. Amen. But when I enter into worship, I get deeper. Yes. I go beyond what he has done. Mm -hmm. And I get to who he is. I remember I used to attend a particular church. And uh, we used to praise. Come mm -hmm. on, praise. Yes. You would go down chini kwa chini. Panda juta remuka. And then you feel good. Yes. And you would feel everybody is excited, shouting. Mm. But then when it came to worship, you'd hear in Jesus' name. Amen, we worship. Unaskia <laughs> umekauka. When you hear now me switch, is it getting serious? Yes. Amen. You're left like you wondered. I've just overcome heaviness. Yes. I've just overcome what I was carrying with. Uh -huh. I just wanted to get into the presence of God. Yes. I believe our viewer, if you're a worship leader there, or if you're a worshiper, that is a way, it's not a formula, it's a way that has worked. It is and true. I believe sometimes you just be in the presence of God. Mm -hmm. You don't even need introduction. Yes. You don't even need to dance. Mm -hmm. You just say you're holy. You're worthy. You're worthy. You're beautiful. You deserve. You deserve the glory. Awesome. And your spirit just flows in worship. It is true. Amen. True. So the message of the song is very, very important. important. Yes. And finally, mm -hmm. the vocal ability of the worship leader. Hallelujah. Hey, Pastor Gi. Hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, mara mingi anatufanya vocal rehearsals. And he's powerful at that. Kuna nyimbo naona zingine unapatia dada zipi. Zingine unapea furaha. Zingine niwe unajipea. Hallelujah. Zingine naona tunaongoza tu mimi ama Pastor Dan. Ni nini hasa kama tuseme kiongozi wa team umelana uh, kufanya ndio ujue huyu anafaa vizuri kwa hii beat, kwa hii song na si huyu. Uh, kwanza unaangalia capacity ya mtu. Uh -huh. Capacity yake ya sauti ikoje. Uh -huh. Anaizemba low ama, ama anaizemba high uh -huh. ama hapo katikati. Uh -huh. So una balance. Nikuye. So wakati unapanga song unaangalia hiyo song inaanzaje na inaishaje sababu kuna songs zingine zinaanza zikiwa chini alafu the moment zinaenda isha zimekuwa zi juu uh -huh. so lazima uangalie hiyo mtu unapea anaweza ku maintain chini na juu okay. so ndio unampa hiyo song kama hawezi maintain unatafuta zile ni mteremko yes unampa hiyo inaenda straight ile inaenda straight <laughs> yeah muimbaji anaweza kuwa anaweza develop akuwe huyo muimbaji wa straight aende anaweza aenda chini na juu ya yeah, inawezekana inalingana uh -huh. na bd ya Sasa mtu. ni bidii yako ndio itafanya uimbe mahali pote. Kwa mfano kama mimi naweza imba popote. Uh, Sina limit. Naweza imba chini, naweza imba juu. So inalingana na bidii ya mtu. Nikwe. Wakati unaweka bidii unafanya practice, unafanya utafiti zaidi mm -hmm. so unapenya kila mahali. Ni kweli. Wow, that is powerful. Mm -hmm. Kuna kitu huwa inaniudhi Pastor Dan. Yes. Tell me whether it has with you. Mm -hmm. We are still about choice of songs. <laughs> Munaenda kuimba song mm -hmm. mtu ajui maneno yes. na na struggle kuisema na nataka aiongoze na, na, 
Hey, <laughs> Jesus. Hey. The In that case, the how do you handle that? Now, now that you are all, on, uh, maybe if you're on the platform. Yes. Or on the <laughs> altar like this, and you are singing. Hey. And this one insists to sing. Uh -huh. Now you just get disappointed and you wait. You wait. Because now you and don't you want take to bring communal, embarrassment. You share in the communal shame. Yeah, because you don't want to begin to, <laughs> <laughs> to, to bring the... Um, unless you are a senior person in that team, yes. you can take charge. Yes. Because there is something that I always say that sometimes, and this should go to all worship leaders or, yes. or song leaders. Yes. Every time that you're the song leader, yes. I always realize that you're the one in charge of the service at that particular time. It's true. So the moment you realize either the beat is not okay, mm -hmm. or the key is not okay, yes. or someone is not singing the way it should be, mm -hmm. you have the right to stop it. To stop it. And start it right. And start it right. Yes. Don't 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 allow things to go haywire. It's true. Because you're the one in charge at that particular time. God is counting on you it's true. at that particular moment over that service. Amen. Yes. And you know the Holy Spirit is not the order of confusion. It is true. Anytime the guitar doesn't sound right mm -hmm. or one voice doesn't sound right. Yes. But it is because everything has to be <laughs> in harmony. Order. It has to be order. <laughs> So, uh, gone are the days where all of us are, were competing. Uh, we used to be in Ushago. Oh, yeah. Um, mm -hmm, Did mm -hmm. you have them in your village? Hey, this one would begin to sing before she finishes. Yes. Another one starts. And now, and I chukuri a katikati. Kwanza. Nandi wa chukuri, they must change the key. Yes. Ah. <laughs> May God deliver us. Help us. Hey. So, um, I believe all this is supposed to help us to become better worshippers. That is true. We are not judgmental, we are not the best, but at least we are, we are trying to share with you that what we true. already know yes. and what has worked for because us. Because God has helped us to walk the journey. Amen. Because this is a journey. Yes. Becoming a good worship leader yes. or a song leader. Yes. You didn't just wake up and then you know which song should follow which. And sometimes I'm, I don't like us saying song leader. Worship leader is better. It is because true. Because when you're it a song true. leader, you mm. can be a choir master. <laughs> Exactly. Doing this and never doing anything mm -hmm. and never singing. Mm -hmm. Or the song can be anything, but the minute you put worship is very it is specific. True. It is specific. It's that very is true. specific. That is true. So be be because I was I was I was thinking yes. we, we should realize mm -hmm. even in the order the songs yes. as you lead worship. What should come after what? Oh. Which song should follow which song? Because you could take us in, in a way that yes. we will lose God in the midst of the songs. Amen. Because if <laughs> you don't allow the songs to, to be systematic, yes. you can take us from Baba. Then we'll answer Shetani ni takusema kwa baba ni takusema now. Now, Amen. as a worship leader, uh -huh. you should allow in your spirit yes. that there is a well of songs mm -hmm. that you can know which song to pick after which song. Amen. Today we are going to break protocol a bit and I'm going to ask Ken a question. Um, for instance, I'm doing a Lingala song. I kindly give him the microphone, let him come forward. He represents. Next time, Koko is the one who will be talking. Bless the Lord. For instance, I'm singing a Lingala song, and I want to transition to sing a Chakacha, a Chakacha, Chaka, Chakacha, Chakacha, Chakacha. Okay, I want to do a Chakacha song. How do I transition without appearing funny? Uh, number one, you need to, I believe, before you come to the stage, you have done practices with the musicians. Yes. And now they know from song one to song two how, mm -hmm. you'll, be, how you'll be joining song two from song one. Mm -hmm. Now, you are from seven, you are going to the chakacha. Mm -hmm. uh, you don't just come in directly, mm -hmm. you need to coordinate with the musicians. You have to have an interlude. Yes, an interlude in between there. Yes. Then a musician, they can do something uh, like arrangement, they can. Uh, maybe they have arranged something, yes. an introduction to the chakacha. Okay. So after that, then they give you a signal whereby you're supposed to be coming in now with the, the following song. Agreed. Yes. Thank you so much, Ken. I believe we are learning a lot. Our audience, we celebrate you. Thank you for being so patient and being wonderful people. Our audience, can we hear a celebration from you? Amen. We are entering into a season of just worshiping. Kindly join us. Feel free to worship God in the, the few minutes that are remaining. Even our viewer back at home, it doesn't matter where you are. You still can sing to God a song. The Bible says in Isaiah 54, sing a song 
you that is barren. Even a barren woman, a barren person. When you talk of barrenness, we are talking of a state of nothingness. You still can worship God. So whatever you are, don't let what you're going through be a hindrance. Just lift up your voice and worship God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh. And Omega, the beginning and the end, my life belongs to you. Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, my life belongs. To you, oh Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, my life belongs to you, Alpha and Omega, Alpha and Omega, the beginning and
Hallelujah. Thank you, Are Lord. you ready to dance for the Lord a little bit? Okay. Come on, let's give him a shout of praise. Let's give him a shout of praise. Hallelujah. Come on, let's give him all the praise. Let's give him all the praise. Zame papa, na yoka kombo na yona sango, lelo yo papa ina lingi na mona na miso. Zame papa, na yoka kombo na yona sango, lelo yo papa ina lingi na mona na miso. Zame papa, na yoka kombo na yona sango, lelo yo papa ina lingi na mona na miso. Zame papa, na yoka kombo na yona sango, lelo yo papa. Zambe papa, na yoka kombo na yona sango, lelo yo papa e na lingi na mona na miso. Zambe papa, na yoka kombo na yona sango, lelo yo papa e na lingi na mona na miso. Na lingi na mona na miso, na bomo ina ngai, loko la ba miso suba mona yo ngape na mona yo papa e. Zambe papa, na yoka kombo na yona sango, lelo yo papa e. Na lingi na mona na miso na bomo ina ngai loko la ba miso suba mona yo ngape na mona yo zambe zambe papa na yo na mona na miso na lingi na mona na miso Na lo bali susu ni nzambe yo zali kaka nzambe yoko kani na moto te yoko tika la kaka nzambe. Nzambe papa na yo kaka mo na yo nzambe. Nzambe yo papa na lingi na mo na na miso. Na lingi na mo na na miso na bomo ina ngai loko la ba miso suba mo na yo ngape na mo na yo papa. Nzambe papa na yo kaka mo na yo nzambe. Nzambe yo papa. Bo 
Obina kawapi Munachezea kawapi Nani ya Yesu Acheza kwa Yesu cheze Acheza kwa Yesu cheza 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 Abine na Yesu bine Bine na Yesu bina Abine na Yesu bine Abine na Yesu bina As the audience and all of us, mm -hmm. we are having a wonderful time. There is some little moments that are left that you can join us, and that we want to do one more song as our, we are way to close, and that we are we are just not looking forward to closing. We are really having fun. Are sure. you having? Ha are oh, you having fun? Oh my goodness me! I'm enjoying. Ooh, all especially the way. that Iye Papa. Iye Papa. Iye Papa is Iye a powerful Daddy. song. Woo. Amen. Let's go to the next song. Oh my! Glory to God. Tunaku inua ju, 
Aleluya tunakuinua Yesu Amen amen Tunakuinua Aleluya tunakuinua Amen amen Tunakuinua Jehova Aleluya tunakuinua Baba Amen amen Tunakuinua Kuinua Aleluya tunakuinua Kuinua Baba Amen amen Tunakupasifa Aleluya tunakupasifa zote Amen amen Tunakupasifa Tunakupasifa Aleluya tunakupasifa Tunakupasifa Amen amen Oh tunakupasifa Aleluya tunakupasifa Baba Amen amen Tunakupasifa Tunakupasifa Aleluya tunakupasifa Amen amen Alleges, 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 Wapi vigele gele kwa Yesu Kenza Jesu Ale 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 Jesu Alles ist, alles ist, alles ist, alles ist. Inua Jesu, Inua Jesu, Inua, 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 Inua Jesu, Inua. Bariki Yesu bariki 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 Wapi bigala ga Zunguka, 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 Yesu comando, comando, comando. 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 Yesu comando, comando. Yesu comando, comando, comando. Yesu comando, comando, comando. Yesu comando, comando, comando. Tunakuzifu baba, tunakuimbia wewe. 
hoje Eu ele mundo a me unguei Una vez a yote Ok, assim fana o tucufu Jeová de rei Tu na cupenda, tu na cupenda 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 O amigo que alegre é maior What a powerful way to end this show. Mm. It's been your show, Divine Encounter. And this is what I prophesy to you, my viewer. That whatever the enemy had destroyed in your life, there is restoration coming your way. Mm. You can never praise the Lord and remain the same. Hallelujah. All the enemies of your joy, all the enemies of your gladness, today they are destroyed in the name of Jesus Christ. For the Bible says, with joy shall we draw from the wells of salvation. Mm -hmm. Your well of salvation carries everything you need. May you receive everything you need. May you receive your healing. Mm. May you receive your deliverance. May you receive your provision. Yes. May you receive everything that you oh, need no. internally and externally. And if you're there, you're not born again. And you want to make Jesus your Lord and Savior. Write to us. Or you can say this prayer after me. Lord Jesus, come into my life. I confess I'm a sinner. And I need your salvation. I'm born again today. Until we meet next time. It's Reverend Ruth Wamoyo. And I done him. And the city and band. Hallelujah. See you next time. Same time. God bless you. Thank <laughs> you.